It is now in order to consider Amendment Number 12, printed in Part C of House Report 111126. For what purpose does the gentleman from New York rise? I rise in support of the amendment, which I have at the desk. The clerk will designate the amendment. Amendment Number 12, printed in Part C of House Report Number 111-126, offered by Mr. Ackerman of New York. Pursuant to House Resolution 464, the gentleman from New York, Mr. Ackerman, and a member opposed, each will control five minutes. The chair recognizes the gentleman from New York, Mr. Ackerman. Thank you very much, Mr. Chairman. Mr. Chairman, I offer this uh, uh, simple amendment on behalf of myself and the gentleman from New York, Mr. Crowley. Uh, This has to do with uh, safety trumping garbage. It has to do with common sense. The City of New York uh, Department of Sanitation has proposed a marine transfer station. Uh, These are generally built on the shoreline uh, because the trash is compacted there and put on barges and then carted away uh, on the uh, Long Island Sound or the East River or the Hudson River. Uh, Of all the shoreline places to build this, would you suspect the one place that would be picked by the Department of Sanitation would be directly opposite one of the biggest active runways, one of the most active runways in the whole United States of America, where planes take off and land approximately every 20 seconds. I'm talking about LaGuardia Airport, uh, the airport with the largest number of flights in New York York City. Uh, This is um, an aerial view of the airport. This is LaGuardia Airport's runway. LaGuardia Airport, most people don't know, has only two runways for all of these great number of flights. The garbage plant is planned right over here opposite the runway, 2,000 feet away. The rules and regulations of the FAA, which is what we're asking for in this amendment to be implemented and utilized, say that you should not put a garbage treatment plant anywhere near the runway protection zone, which is currently 2,000 feet away. This is 2,000 feet according to, less than that, according to this map, which we downloaded from Google. Uh, There will be a new flight slope plan implemented that the FAA has approved, which says it can't be within 2,500 feet. Why would you put a garbage facility, an attractant to birds, less than 2,000 feet away from one of the most active runways. The gentleman from New York, Mr. Hall, requested of the FAA. uh, They declined, and Secretary of Transportation LaHood overruled them and released the number of bird strikes at airports around the country. Last year, there were 87 bird strikes at LaGuardia Airport alone. Uh, Now, our pilots are good. Uh, You might have seen uh, a little news report that say they can even land on water. Uh, And indeed, that's what happened when one of our jets was struck by birds. Garbage is an attractant to birds. The FAA rules and recommendations say don't put these things in the runway protection zone. Our amendment simply says to the FAA, you have to follow your own guidelines. Put it anywhere else. There's a political concern uh, here, and the political concern is not a NIMBY concern. This will most likely be in mine or Mr. Crowley's district. It borders both of our districts right now. Uh, This site is the least politically damaging to us because it's in a commercial area. Any other place that they will move it will cause us some political concerns. But those political concerns that we will have to suffer if they move this anywhere up and down the coast in either of our districts is not as important to the safety of the flying public. Reserve the balance of my time. 